Yes, now you can hear me. <laughs> Thank you very much uh, for the introduction. And uh, first say, Alvaro, great job, man, about the page. So I'm very happy now we have this tool page for the chatbot because uh, it was also uh, a lot of questions last year when people want to promote the chatbot and don't know how to do it. So now actually they have also the page to um, really to promote it. And uh, it's so professional. Great job, Alvaro. So guys, yeah, the new chatbot uh, is coming and it will be released today. Um, it's the second version of the chatbot. Uh, we already have one uh, in our back office with the Funnel Club. And uh, that was only the beginning and it's working fine, but we added more features like the Instagram chapel, but also a lot of other stuff like variables I'm going to show you in a while. And uh, the great stuff is from Bill Roll, of course, so you can connect unlimited accounts, unlimited pages, and it's great for agencies. So you can really make money with the chatbot tool as an agency. So um, I'm going to share my screen. I think you see my screen now, right? Okay, so uh, why using a chatbot? Uh, first, uh, you can automate your business. Second, uh, the opening click-through rates are much higher than email. And what you can do is what they call multi-channel marketing. Uh, that's using email, SMS, WhatsApp, but also Instagram, uh, even Messenger and Facebook Messenger to, um, yeah, to uh, first generate leads, of course, because you want to generate leads, but also uh, to follow up with sales. There are a lot of stuff you can do with chatbots. It's not only an application generate leads, but uh, yeah, it's also usable for, uh, for example, I'm going to show you how I did it. For example, when you do a Facebook Live and you want to have a lot of um, uh, interaction with the people which are watching your live, for example. And um, there are many use cases and uh, I don't go through them all one -on one but just want to show you a tool first because when you dive into dashboards, the people which have premium and funnel club, they will see this. For example, when you go to your back office and you go here down to new message chatbot. So this is the new version you have access to, okay? So first of all, once you click on it, you have to connect your accounts. And uh, so once you connect an account, then you can add an account and you have to connect with Facebook first. And then it will pull all your accounts or also, sorry, all your Facebook pages you have, for example, access to as an administrator of your owner. So when I go here, then you see here the pages which I can link directly to this account. So I, I already did that, but uh, yeah, you can set up multiple accounts, for example, if you also want to connect uh, the pages of, uh, of your clients if you're running an agency, okay? It's very easy, just link them. It will also ask access to the pages and uh, then they are connected. So I will delete this one because I already have one. Cool, so when I go to my accounts, uh, I have two accounts now connected, uh, Build All Netherlands Facebook account and Build All Instagram Netherlands account. And building a chatbot here, uh, uh, for example, if you create flows, is exactly the same if you build a messenger chatbot flow or an Instagram chatbot flow. And also you can use, for example, if you build a messenger flow, uh, you easily can export this flow and import it in your Instagram flow. And it's exactly the same. You can use, so you don't have to rebuild all your messenger flows into Instagram again. Uh, there are some differences between uh, the Facebook flows and the Instagram flows if it comes to building a chatbot and using, for example, the automations. When you go first to Messenger, you see here you can build your flows first. So I'm going to give you a short demo uh, how easy it is. But when it comes to automation, then you can have, for example, in Messenger, Messenger reply rules. So if people, for example, type stop inside your, uh, your Messenger, they unsubscribe or they type in unsubscribe. They will unsubscribe also when they type in ebook, you can start a flow to deliver the ebook. So you can ask them the email, you can ask them the phone number. The email will shoot directly to your mailing boss five list and the phone number also will be captured. So you can use also for SMS, for example, or for WhatsApp messages. Of course, you need a get started button, but now we also have a persistent menu where you can, for example, get people directly to the first step like website or for example, so this is Dutch, but 14 day free trial or for example, to your course or free course. If you want to use the persistent menu, then you have to disable also some stuff and also disable your get started button. So people only see your menu instead of get started. So when they press the get started button, then your flow will be activated. Um, we also have, uh, let me see, conversation starters. So that's almost the same as the persistent menu only you can redirect them through Messenger through a flow directly instead of to a website or to a link to your page if you have a webinar, for example. When you go to Instagram, when you go to automation, then you see here the difference. We have a story mention automation, but also story replies. That means uh, if someone mentioned you in a story in Instagram, you can select a flow which you want to get started. 
And that's great stuff to deliver, for example, an incentive or a thank you that they mentioned you. Uh, for example, a coupon code for your product or for your course, because they mentioned you, you want to reward those guys. So you can use it also for different applications, but it's very powerful, especially for influencers. If they have, for example, just launched a new YouTube video, you can also give them the link to the, uh, to the new YouTube video to watch the video, or maybe if you're an influencer to the product with a coupon code you are promoting. Same is with story replies. So if someone is replying on the story, you also can uh, activate a flow. You can trigger a flow, which you get started. And uh, yeah, also very powerful, for example, uh, if you want to deliver, for example, also eBooks or, uh, uh, or free trainings or just, uh, for example, an incentive uh, for the people which just replied on your Instagram message. The same we have here as conversation starters. The only difference you see here, we have story mentions and story replies for Instagram. But for the rest, we all have the same stuff. Also for Instagram, we have a live chat now. So you can have a live chat. If people, for example, are messaging you in a DM, you can take over here if you want in the back office. And you also see here which people you just interacted with, okay? And again, uh, when you are using, uh, for example, Instagram, uh, the app itself, uh, I think they call it native, then you are always able to reply even after a week to those guys. But please bear in mind, if you're using the Facebook chatbot, it's also very, uh, very important to know the rules for Facebook, for example, the 24 hour rule. If you're using third party tools, like for example, uh, the Facebook, uh, you've, sorry, the build all chatbot platform, you need to know that uh, you are not allowed to send up messages from the build all chatbot outside 24 hour window. Uh, but soon we also will have one time notification option also in a chatbot. So then people give you, uh, will give you permission to send them a message about that certain for example, webinar they registered or something like that. So I hope we'll have it this week uh, in uh, in our tool and uh, they're already working on it. So uh, that will be available even also. But you see here, the menu is almost the same. Um, when you build a flow, I just opened this flow, it's just with drag and drop cards. So uh, you were able to organize your complete cards with all the flows and this looks very complicated, but I can show it's not to um, yeah, to see uh, the also the complete flow and you see also uh, when the next button is connected to the phone number, for example. So it's visual, it's visual building your canvas and that's a huge improvement. And uh, when you see the first uh, version of the build all chatbot, uh, this is really, really better. So people understand what they are doing. So if you are creating a new flow, for example, and I call it test two, I click on okay, then I can start building here. So the first step is always the starting step and the starting step will always be one message. When you click here, add message action, then you have to uh, then you can choose between a menu or uh, or features you want to use to start a message with. And mostly with the starting step, it's mostly image and buttons or just message with the buttons because they have to click to the next step to activate the next step. So in this case, we use message with buttons. Just click here, for example, to um, for example here you can navigate to a URL call to action, but we do an other action because we want to go to the next step. Okay. And here you can change the text. Hello, are you interested in my free course? Okay, then you can click here and say, so the button will be, yes, I am. And you can choose the action here, but in this case, we choose other action because we want to go on to the next step. Okay, so this is the first step. Then when you click on the plus, then this will be step one, I call it step one. Okay, and then I will drag and drop it here. And then I will say here, uh, I can choose between the simple text, image and buttons, message with buttons, message with media, quick replies. Yeah, I think that's too much to explain in this short meeting now uh, what they're all about, but you can also send out videos. Uh, so message with a video, short video or audio, even MP3 image or a custom file like a PDF. You can ask questions. Uh, you can subscribe to a schedule, so that's an automation. Uh, and, uh, you can compare it with email automation. You can follow up automatically after one hour, two hours, three hours, and, and yeah, you are able to, uh, to create a complete funnel inside your chatbot. You can set a variable value type action. That's uh, also the pause uh, you just also saw on the page uh, Alvaro was explaining. You can send data to mailing boss, so to mailing boss five. So you can capture your email and send it to mailing boss. And there also you can start an automation. You can send data to a webhook, send an SMS directly from the chatbot. But for that, you need, of course, credits for your SMS. And you can go to the SMS tool and buy some credits because it will send out from a chatbot and that needs money. 
Uh, and you can send an email directly from a chatbot, uh, even using emails you captured uh, in, um, uh, in your chatbot flow. So in this case, we will say, uh, let's see here, uh, you address it, okay. So uh, type here, cool. Uh, uh, first you can, for example, insert variable. So that's the customer's email, the customer name. But in this case, we use the first name. Great to hear. So the next step, uh, sorry, I have typos here. So next step, I ask your email. Okay. So just connect this one. Oh, sorry. Uh, do a thing wrong. This one to here. All right. And then a new one. And this is step two. So you can build block by block. And in this case, I will ask their email. So I will use ask questions. And I say, what is your email? Your email. And then here you can choose the variable to store that email address. And it's great stuff. You can create as many variables you want because you use this variable to segment those people, for example. So in this case, they go to my free training. But uh, there are also people maybe who go to your webinar or they just uh, download your ebook. And in this case, you can segment those people in a certain variable and then retarget them, for example, with uh, SMS, but also uh, with a follow-up email through your chatbot. So it's very easy to set up. It's very easy also, uh, I have to set up a message, oh yeah. It's very easy to uh, to build a complete flow inside the canvas and uh, also to organize everything in the canvas. And uh, yeah, to, for example, when you, for example, set up your whole flow in here, then you are able also to export your file uh, and share it with your team. But when you want to use it, for example, to promote it, uh, what you can do also is set up ref URLs as they call it, so a ref URL is just a URL you can share, for example, uh, in a button or just on uh, on a QR code. You can create landing pages. You can create the chatbot, uh, even chat for website, that the button on your website where people opt in through your website, or you can run Facebook ads. And that all you can connect to the flow you just created. And everything, all the information you are gathering will be stored here. So here you can manage variables. So here you can create as many variables you want. But also all the stuff is stored here, the collected data, and you can ex also export it to a CSV file. And uh, for example, if you're using it, uh, if you are working uh, as an agency uh, and you work for a client, they want to import it to uh, their own CRM, for example, then they can import all the information you just captured with your chatbot inside their CRM system. And um, yeah, this is a great, great future uh, we have now in uh, our chapel because uh, yeah, a lot of data, you want to collect the data. It's very important to collect data, not only for yourself or marketing, but also um, yeah, to follow up through SMS or email. And uh, this is really, really powerful. So the variables, I'm very happy with that because uh, yeah, with that, uh, yeah, you can grow your business very fast if you ask a lot of questions uh, inside the chatbot. This is also a great future. It's a common responder. Uh, you can do it with Facebook. You can set up a post, for example, and uh, you can pick a post. So this will guide to the post I used for this comment. But in this case, you can uh, ask a comment, for example, comment uh, if a fun club, and I will uh, I will give you the free trial. So uh, also great for eBooks. But what I did uh, last week or two weeks ago, I set up a live stream in here on my Facebook page, and I connected uh, this post to the auto comment responder. So when people uh, were on my live stream and uh, when they comment, for example, free trial, they get a free trial to the Build All Chatbot, but also when they comment yes, they will receive uh, a notification for the Deep Dive Chatbot uh, training. They can subscribe for the Deep Dive Chatbot training I will host, uh, in, uh, so I think, in a few weeks. And when you're doing a live and you can set up an autoresponder like this in Messenger and people comment, you get a lot of interaction with your, uh, with your Facebook Live. Uh, so Facebook Live, uh, if your Facebook likes, uh, that people are commenting uh, and uh, it will boost automatically also uh, your life organically to the people which are connected to your pages. And uh, yeah, this is really, really great to use for Facebook lives. But also if you want to, for example, start a Facebook ad, you set up a post, you connect it to it, you set up uh, your autoresponder like comment ebook or comment free trial, you are going to promote it. And uh, when people see a lot of comments under a post, they think, oh, something is happening there. 
and they will uh, they will they will certainly try it out what you were offering also and comment the same under the other comments. So the comment replies in here. So the comment responder is very powerful. You can do the same also here in Instagram. Just pick a post. So if you add a post, you can pick a post in here and uh, you can select a post. And then also, uh, then you are able also at the reply rule. And uh, then you can select one of the flows you just created. And uh, you can choose send with without conditions. So um, I always send without conditions because when someone is replying on this post, then uh, I want to get out this message very fast. But you can also, uh, for example, set up a delay if you want uh, if you want to delay message. But I usually don't do that because uh, yeah, you want to send out the message directly to those people. Okay. And um, yeah, there are so many things, guys, to go through. Uh, yeah. It's too much now to uh, yeah, to show you guys in this uh, in this live stream. So maybe we can do a separate one, maybe on a Tuesday night training or something like that. But um, yeah, yeah good, actually, this is uh, a short version of uh, the tool. What you can do with it, and uh, yeah, and uh, actually, it's not difficult uh, to um, to create a flow uh, with a chatbot, mm -hmm. like also a Faro set. Um, first is. You have to uh, to think about a strategy. What's your purpose using the chatbot? What do you want to collect and what you want to deliver? And then what I always do is take a piece of paper. I draw the whole flow first. So I have a visual and then build it inside uh, inside build all with the chatbot. And then also to test it, of course, because before you're going to, for example, promote it, you want to test it first if it's working uh, or not. So uh, that's very important. But uh, yeah, a lot of people also ask me, uh, this chatbot, can you compare it with ManyChat? I think we are near ManyChat now uh, because ManyChat, yeah, that's the tool there. That's their focus, you know, it's their, um, their main business. Uh, but this is a tool which is integrated build all. So you don't need Zapier or whatever you need with ManyChat because ManyChat, you need a lot of third party tools to send out an SMS or whatever you need. In build all, you just can use the integrations we have here. And uh, yeah, then also select uh, also integrations you need. And we are close also to integrate WhatsApp. And uh, yeah, then you have SMS, WhatsApp, uh, and then Instagram together with uh, with Facebook Messenger and email, everything you need. To get it's, it's, it's not only that, Wasily, on top of that, not only do we have everything you need, there's somebody somewhere that's going to go, we don't have something that I need. <laughs> and so that's where the webhooks come in. And then you can webhook it out and then do with that data whatever you want if you need a third party system to process that information in some other way. Or if you've got clients, here's the here's the kicker that all of you should be running out there and starting a chatbot agency because you can build as many of these as you want to. You, you're, you're not limited to how many you can build. And then you can webhook that information out. So if you're getting if you're setting it up to be able to get your customer leads, you don't want necessarily your customer to get into your builder all account to access those leads. So you can still process them however you need to as an agency, but also send that information out so they can process it on their end as well. So you provide the chatbot and you provide the ability to get the leads and then you deliver the leads outside to them so then they can do whatever they want with those leads. So seriously, chatbot agency, man, you guys are you guys are set up to be able to do that right now. Yeah. What you can do is, uh, for example, uh, everything is integrated and what I'm doing with my business in the Netherlands for the fitness industry is uh, to create done for you layouts, blueprints uh, for them, uh, the whole chapel template, but also the lead capture pages. So they have a lead capture page, they have a chapel template, they have email marketing. And uh, then you create a very simple tutorial because it's not very difficult to set it up. They just have to import it. And now uh, I also forgot, we have the auto tag function also in the chatbot. So if you're using auto tag, just like an email, uh, even the mailing boss, uh, when they download, for example, uh, their, uh, their uh, uh, had the file of a chatbot, the whole blueprint, they only have to put in their own links for example, to the website, to the booking tool, to the affiliate link, whatever. And then it will import everything with their own link inside uh, the chapel template. So they don't have to edit anything. So uh, that's really powerful agencies or if you want to share it with, for example, in a team. Uh, have, uh, for example, if you are a uh, build all ambassador or you build all affiliate, you have your own team and your own downline, you can share your template with your lead capture page and they can import it. And within a few minutes, they uh, can put in their link into their own links. And they are up and running. So uh, multi-level marketing, whatever, it's so powerful to use that. And uh, yeah, there are a lot of ways to use a chatbot. Yeah. Well, it might have been a short demo, but it was of great content, great quality. So we appreciate that, Wasili, for stopping by and sharing some really good stuff. Um, and I know. And have... don't forget that Jackie's going to bring. She's going to bring on the training. That's right. So uh, there's already a bunch of training inside the uh, the knowledge base, 
and uh, she's got more coming. She'll be updating. And for heaven's sakes, if you have any questions, do not miss her Friday live where you can go on live with her and she can show you uh, in that meeting. You can ask her and she'll show you um, anything you need to know about the chat bot, whether it's the messenger side or the Instagram side. So you can already go to knowledge base and get some information. She's going to have more training available and it is going to be fling and fling and awesome. <laughs>